Alrighty, YouTube. Welcome back to uh, the long haul. Uh, day 18. I've died like three times overnight trying to get my backpack. I don't know if I mentioned it at the end of the last episode, but I was going for a shovel, a little shoveling up some treasure, and and I couldn't find the treasure in in one in the first treasure, but I died going for the second treasure, and well. And it led to a series of events. We're up to nine deaths now, but don't really care. It like I cannot emphasize this enough. Enough. It's a this is a casual series. You know, for me, it's just like, and I'll admit, I'm not the best at playing video games. Well, not the best at video games, nor do I claim to be. I'm just running over to grab. Hopefully get the other treasure, and it shouldn't be that hard to do because it's uh, snow, and I can thankfully one-hit blocks once I get my get all my junk back. Here's the good old mini bike. You can see the zombies guarding my stuff. Um, well, I'm looking for my backpack. Ah, oh, um, well. I'll have to kite these zombies away from it for a second. Um, I found treasure radius, but I'm not worried about that. I'll just grab some of that, and we'll grab. We'll just start putting stuff in. No, go away, you guys. Um, well, I need a... So just give me a second, I'll put my stuff on and also my uh and i'll find the treasure for you hopefully quickly so just give me a second please Alrighty, we found the treasure chest lovely stuff let's see a rocket launcher stock and 5400 dukes i'll take it good little payout okay so it's about i had to take on a whole take out i took out all the zombies you know i think we're too hard so Easy to, easy enough to take on. Puffer coat. I don't have any cloth on me at the moment, but we'll just save it for for once I do. Oh, speaking of cloth fragments, excellent stuff. I still need a little bit more. We'll actually just throw that in, and well. Uh, we'll just throw out the jar. There we go. Throw that all in, and we're looking, we're looking fabulous again. So let's uh, let's uh, drive over to. I'm gonna drive right back over to town, and and give me just a second. Okay, YouTube folks, it's. I'm already back at base uh i need to heal up so i need you know figured best way to do that would be to eat up some food and uh some decent food and also get in the uh get in some painkillers which i believe i have i do have plenty of eggs i've been collecting throughout the journey but down those and i'm thinking need to do some more um some more progress on the uh, on the old uh, base you know, get it all squared away looking nice and everything like that uh, really should focus on it uh, checking out my iron situation here though we're looking good on iron at the moment so I do need to give it some wood uh, give me one second here while I just sort it out I think what would be a good idea at the moment would be to take what brass I got and make some bolt casings, and then with my lead at the moment, I'll make some more uh, buckshot for shotgun shells. But I do need to grab some more resources, and of course get myself healed up. So let me get let me get some resources and. Get myself healed up, and I will tune in with you uh, once I'm doing more base upgrades. Oh. 
Well, YouTube, uh, not, I'm still gathering resources around here, but I uh, found a uh, airdrop that I missed from the other day. So that's a cool to see, uh, one that I completely forgot about. Let's check it. First aid kits and some antibiotics and a, a flashlight, so very nice stuff there. I'll just throw the um, flashlight on and I accidentally <laughs> dropped my ammo on the SMG because of the, uh, dropped my ammo on the ground for the SMG because of issues with that, but you know, I was just collecting resources over here in the winter biome, and uh, if I uh, thought I should update you on that. Nice to find that because I, I logged out because like, of issues um, with uh, mic stuff on stream, so but cool to hear. See you in a little bit. Okay, YouTube, I'm, I'm just rolling back into town here. I did a pretty hefty grind of stones, uh, got like a, a well over 2,000 stones, and Got me over a thousand clay just for you'd keep uh, make sure I got bullet casings and I and uh, bullet tip production going along with forged iron. Been really uh, leveling up the uh, iron pickaxe for the most part, just just so I have a good one for if I decide to go to the wasteland. It's at level 385 now. Really good stuff. It's doing pretty good. So. Yeah, we'll just make another one of those, get another one of those started. Actually, perfect timing, because I just ran out of fuel in the, in the, in the forge here for getting, uh, it wasn't really smelting much, but I digress. I also maxed out a stack of iron, so, um, we'll make a, what I'm actually going to do here is I'm going to make, like, another thousand sand just just to get that going I had some cement going so get another a bunch of that got all that crafting in so you know we'll at least have something to keep going so that's the that sand is just go with just rapid fire and it's uh, really fun so um but you know I do, I know I was, I said I was going to start working on the base some more, but that'll probably be an overnight thing for me, so. Um, oh, I completely forgot to turn on the forge again, so. Just get that going, we'll throw the raw iron in and all that. Our pickaxe is ready, we'll see how this is, uh, for quality. We are level 398, which is excellent to see. We're almost in the blue quality, and I have made myself more shotgun ammo and and uh, 9mm. It's a it's something to keep me going, you know. Need a lot of it, so. Once that clay gets in, probably start smelting in more uh, lead and then also some brass, but Let's do a little raiding, shall we? Um, trying to think, what do we have? Can't remember what's down in the uh, south western corner. We'll go cruise over that. You know, I figured you, know, while we're driving over there, discuss you. Know, someone asked me in stream the other day at the time for, uh, you know, what I'm playing at the moment, you know outside of seven days it's like seven if you are watching YouTube uh, this YouTube channel for a while you would know that uh, this channel is a, a seven days to die focus channel and so it's a little but I do play other games outside of this so I do play Fallout 4 next gen uh, well the PS5 version of Fallout 4 it's uh, and I'm really happy with it it's a excellent little thing to have on a uh, next gen you know it's like fix all the issues like there would be an issue with uh, got a prison here which is really cool um it's a but it's really fun I, I would go into the issues but um let's focus on the old uh, prison here 
three shot doors with no problems. Let's take care of a couple of the zombies out here. Uh, didn't quite one shot you, but Blunderbuzz started to break a little bit. So take care of you and Psycho Steve. Hello. There you go. And we'll and you got his brother over here. There we go. Check him out for loot too. Um, not much on you. Well, nothing. And has my boots off you. That's a that's kind of hard to find. <laughs> well, hard to find these days. Step away from the mini bike, please. I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you. It's just me not one to damage the mini bike. Don't really need to give it more of a struggle. Go away. I'll take care of uh, Charlie and we'll, we'll let the zombie uh, that's been beating on stuff uh, have their have their fun in the garage. They'll eventually join me. I'll just take care of the nurse. You're gone. And Curly needs his uh, his healthy helping of you know, water bus for the day. There we go. So yeah, um, let me get, let me break into the safes uh, in this place, and uh, I will show you the loot. Okay, and I've broken into all the safes in this place, and all the guard towers. The pistol barrel, uh, that's really, I'm not going to save it, because that really doesn't do much for me at this point. Anything below level 100, I'll scrap. Uh, decent pistol parts, McDiver's book, that's pretty good, so... Take that, and then we got the chainsaw blade, the chainsaw schematic. That's pretty cool to see. Gun safe, magnum frame, hunting rifle parts, which I was looking for. Two of them, in fact. Their crappy pistol barrel, decent shotgun receiver. So, um, let's try to think here. Oh, we'll just put this together. We'll put this pistol together and. There we go. Might have to drop a little bit of loot in the mini bike, but it really isn't. I'm really not too worried about that. Um, just give me one little second here while I drop loot, and it sounds like there's a zombie I'm trying to come in here. Oh, yep, it's just a, it's just a crawler. Well, no, wait, that was actually just a. Uh, TV boy. Mikey! Come here. You know you want the blunderbuss. There you go. There you go. Oh, mini bike where you at? There we are. Just throw some loot in there and... It's so nice having the mini bike for storage now, so... Um, throw that puffer coat on. Actually, I have to crouch down, so... Iron desk, we'll take it for leather. Nothing in you. Last safe in here, but... Hunting knife book, I'll just scrap it. Pistol grip isn't so bad, like... It's it's giving me lots more, um... Giving me more quality levels. Place still isn't done yet, though. We got some, uh... Got some corp. I got the corpses here, so got a couple of magnum parts. So, man, if uh, we're lucky, we might have a full magnum from this raid alone. And I found if you watch my co-op series uh, on YouTube, you will when you initially break the spotlights for for um what do you call it um from the prison here. It's like, yeah, you can just break them with a pickaxe, but if you want to take them uh, with again, then you need to have the, you need to have a good old, um, um, you need to have the wrench. It's like, it is unusual with these, it's like, they will, you can pick them up with a pickaxe when you first uh, grab them out of the prison, but once you place them down, you need a wrench. It's like, the special animation doesn't play on the on the, uh, like the, pri on the, 
I was in the prison. It's like, uh, I don't know what is up with that. Um, aside from the spotlight, there's not much in that tower. I thought all these towers had a had a good uh, good chance to give the well had a corpse in them, but oh well, it's no it's no worries. So um, nothing in this tower for the bottom at least. Should be someone up here. Hello. Yep. Nope. Nothing in the. Oh, un unlocked door. Don't need a break. Don't need to break that. I have that tendency sometimes. No worries though. Grab the third spotlight. I'll use it for the base. Uh, you know, once it gets uh, finally put together. So we're not breaking in through that door. It's just a little silly. So. We'll actually just break through here in this fence. It's just easier, you know, like 300 less hit points, so. I. Okay, I I might have fibbed a little bit. I. I forgot to break into this tower, but. You can see the corpse in there. Check the trash, though. A little bit of. A little bit of scrap iron, so. Um. How oh, good magnum parts, I'll take it. I will never complain about good magnum parts. One of those, I love having the magnum in this game, and it is because of its power. It's a wonderful stuff to have. Nothing in you, but we'll claim your spotlight. So, yeah, I think it was, today's been a pretty successful day, aside from having deaths overnight. It's like, eh, those aren't really much to worry about for me, so. But I hope you, I hope uh, those of you on YouTube, oh, hello there, bear. Oh, boy. Wow, I literally almost uh, went right into the, or uh, lunged right into the, laws of, uh, the claws of a bear. Well, let's see, I, I was about to end the episode, but, um, well, come on, bear. I know you want to, uh, want a piece of me. So, yeah, <laughs> I am not worried about taking on the bear. He's he's not that scary. As, as I was about to get swiped by a bear, but... These guys really aren't that difficult to take on. Once you have a... Something like a crossbow, it's like... Once you have this taken care of, it's like you're... You'll be fine. I know it's about to be nighttime, but... Zombies aren't good. I got my weapons now, so... Question is, how many are you going to take? There we go. He is finally done, so. But anyways, uh, I'm going to end the episode here, so. Hope you all enjoyed, and I thank you all so much for watching. Take care.